Hey guys, welcome to this video and in this video I am going to tell you about the multitasking and multi-window features of Samsung Galaxy S8. So as many of you might know that Samsung is the company that actually pioneered this feature and they are the ones who started it all and uh, the multitasking and multi-window feature actually first appeared on Samsung Galaxy S devices and now everyone is doing it, Apple is doing it, Google is doing it and now pretty much every device has this multi window feature but still to this day samsung does it best and uh, they have done it once again on this device so let's go ahead and take a look at all these multi window features so for that you need to go in settings and in settings go in advanced features and in advanced features look for this option called multi window now here you will see two more options use recents button and pop up view action you need to turn on both of these features and then tap on use recents button and you get two more options so split screen view and snap window now split screen view is basically a feature that you know allows you to launch multi window so you can use two apps side by side and snap window is where it pins a section of a screen on the top and then you can launch another app down below uh, let me show you how it works so let's see how split screen view works and now let's go back and i long press on the recents button and it launches into the multi window feature i can go into more apps and i can use pretty much any app from here to work in this uh, multi window feature let's go ahead with solid explorer so there you go now i'm using two apps side by side and it can increase and decrease the size of the screen i can get even more options so that is how split screen uh, view works let's go in snap window and now let's go back long press on the recents button and here now i can choose any portion of the screen like this and press done and it will pin that portion of the screen on the top and then down below I can launch any other app and then use this information on the top uh, to copy uh, in the other app or to just you know keep it static on the top and you know you can keep any useful information on top and then use any other app down below now let's talk about the next feature it's called pop-up view action and I'm really really excited about this one actually so first turn it on and then what it allows you to do is if you swipe diagonally downward from either corner of the top of the screen it will minimize the screen and you know it will uh, uh, make it a pop-up window so let's go ahead and try this let's go in play store and I will just swipe it diagonally okay it will take few tries and there you go now I have minimized the screen so now I can simply minimize into a floating window and I can maximize it and then I can uh, actually you know just close it and then I can actually increase or decrease the size so you can go long you can go short you can go wider you know whatever suits you so you can do all of this now let's go ahead and launch next one and we will minimize this one as well so there we go so two apps now let's go in YouTube and minimize this one let's launch camera minimize this one so it takes few tries until you perfect this technique of minimizing apps let's do Chrome so I've got five apps here and I can actually you know uh, launch as many apps as I want and then have them in this floating window so let's launch one more let's launch calculator and I'll minimize it and there we go so now I've got six apps here and let's launch them one by one so I've got calculator I've got Chrome I've got my camera I've got my YouTube, I've got my Google. So now I've got five apps on this screen at this point. And that is the maximum amount of apps that you can launch at any one time on the screen. If you launch the next one, it will simply uh, minimize the previous one and will launch the next one. So if I do this, uh, you know, the calculator will be minimized. So if I do this, Google now will be minimized. So at one time, you can only have uh, five windows open on screen. Now, a really powerful feature here is that, for example, if I go in uh, settings and I tap this recent button, it will allow me to launch, uh, you know, two apps side by side. And OK, so this one is not supported. So let's go back into settings so let's launch another one so let's launch solid explorer so i've got two apps here side by side and I'm working in multi window now on top of this i can launch five more apps so let's go ahead and do this 
so there we go as of this moment I have got seven apps working all at the same time on my screen now I know that this is an overkill and nobody is going to use this feature like this but you have an option to do it you have an option to use a lot of apps seven to be exact all at the same time on your screen this is a multitasking power host Samsung just does it the way no other device does and no other manufacturer does it's just a piece of a device and Samsung's multitasking options and multi window options are just killing it in every way so that's about it guys those were the multitasking and multi window features of Samsung Galaxy S8 I hope you've enjoyed this video if you have any questions let me know in the comments and I will see you in the next video guys till then take care bye bye